are joined on our Full Throttle TV set with Zaza Energy Pro Stock driver Erica Enders. Erica, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having me. So not only are you a Pro Stock driver, but you are the most successful female Pro Stock driver in the NHRA. What does that mean to you? I mean, you embrace the fact that you're a woman in a male-dominated sport, but other than that, I mean, I just have always been a avid spokesperson for when you put the helmet on, everything's equal. Gender doesn't play a role in what we do. And I mean, all the, all the records for females and everything is really cool, but at, at the end of the day, I just strive to be the best driver I can. Well, you're back with Tecnasi Racing again, and you have a new sponsor, Zaza Energy. Is your team going to give you the force that you need to push you up to the top? Absolutely. I couldn't have asked for a better group of guys, and I really believe that people are a key to making something successful, and I definitely have the right guys. They've won world championships together with this exact car. This is the car that Jag drove la the last couple years, and um, the horsepower at Kegnazzi Racing is just awesome. So we definitely have, like, all the stars are aligned right now, and we just have to execute. That was my next question. You're driving in Jed Coughlin's old car. He's a full throttle champion. Is do you think you're, it's your turn? You're gonna get up there and you're win your first volley? I sure hope so. I've been, I mean, I've been dreaming about this my whole life, and I've certainly worked really hard at it, trying to find sponsors to come on board to keep us out here, and then traveling all the time, trying to work out, stay in shape, so I can be the best driver I can. It's just, it's a full plate. Well, I have to say you're going pretty fast because in Gainesville you broke the miles per hour record. What did your team do to celebrate after that? Um, we had a little toast, a full throttle toast. Um, <laughs> But we, um, we just all got together, and, and my teammate Roger Brogdon set the ET world record as well. He won a 49 with a 5. So he set the ET. We have the quickest and the fastest pro stock cars in the world at Cagnazzi Racing. So um, we celebrated as a group, and it was just a lot of fun. Not only did you break the record, but you went up against... NASCAR superstar Kurt Busch. Kurt Busch. How was that? Were you nervous? Was it pressure? How, would, how did you feel? I didn't think going into it because my Sunday game plan stays the same no matter who's in the other lane. But on Sunday with all the all the people, he has a huge entourage and all the cameras. And, you know, then I thought, well, I'm never going to hear the end of it if I lose to this roundy round guy. So I better step up my game. So there was a little added pressure. But um, fortunately, the Zaza Chevy Cobalt came out on top. And that's all I could ask for. So our own FTTV stat man, Lewis Bloom, the guy who knows everything, picked you as his out-of-the-box win to win Pro Stock Class this year. Really? Any pressure from old Lewis Bloom? Oh, I love me some Lewis Bloom. <laughs> but um, I'm honored that they've been picking me. Bob Fry came up to me the other day when we were at an autograph session, and he said, all right, he showed me his ticket. He's like, I placed my bet on you. Your odds are 10 to 1 this weekend. So it makes me feel really good that these guys are putting their faith and their money on me. So um, we're going to see how we can do this year. I have, I have all the faith in the world in my guys, and I think we have a lot to look forward to this year. Want to see more Full Throttle TV? Check us out online anytime at NHRA.com.